Hey there builders, in this video we're going to tackle the sensitive subject of AWS API keys. What are they? When should you use them? Should you use them at all? So it happened again where a team unfortunately had their AWS API keys exposed unnecessarily, putting themselves and their users at risk. Now, fortunately, this was responsibly disclosed and there was no harm done in this case, but it's an issue that I see happening again and again and again. So let's clear it up once and for all. The way to assign credentials within the AWS cloud is using AWS IAM roles, identity and access management roles. Think like an actor, like da-da, a role that something assumes. So if you have an EC2 instance and some ECS containers or Fargate containers that wanna access DynamoDB, you create a role that defines the permissions for accessing DynamoDB. Now each of these instances or containers will assume that role. And in the background, they'll automatically get a set of temporary managed credentials to um, access Dynamo through that role. So it's a way of managing and orchestrating access without actually handing out keys to everybody. Now there are still some scenarios where you'll need keys and that's okay. Regardless of how you're applying those credentials, you wanna make sure that all credentials, whether they're roles or keys, have the bare minimum permissions required to do the job. So when you're in IAM, you see those full access policies, avoid them like the plague. My opinion, they shouldn't even be there. They are for convenience and sometimes it makes sense, but really don't use them. You wanna make sure that you're assigning the bare minimum privileges possible. If you only need to access one key in an S3 bucket, only give the role permissions to access that key in that bucket. Yes, it sounds like it's a pain in the butt. It's not. IAM is a wonderfully um, dynamic system. It's really elegant. It's really simple to assign these permissions. So do your research. Don't give out keys unless you absolutely have to. You want to be using roles and the principle of least privilege.